Java Balls! All right, well, I have lots of great stuff to show you uh, for what's new and exciting over at Java Balls Productions. First of all, I just completed several new how to paint videos. The first one being Necrons. But um, I've decided to kind of up the ante here a little bit for you guys. Uh, instead of just painting one model, I actually painted three. And they're all part of the same set. It's a, it's a, my new uh, approach to doing these videos. And it's a comprehensive how to paint video set. Uh, super deluxe. So let me tell you what we have here. We have um, a, a Necron Warrior basic base model. Uh, this is just designed for newbies to get or vets to get their stuff on the table quick. Say you want a new army, <laughs> here's how you do it. This model took me about oh five minutes. Um, you, you'll see how to do it. Uh, it looks pretty great for hardly any time at all. Then we have a higher level tabletop model. And this guy, uh, not much longer, but you can see he's got some uh, shading and blending. It looks a little dirty and rusty. Uh, I did not dip this model. Oops, I just told you my secret. <laughs> so uh, this model is, is uh, straight up painted, uh, hand painted. But again, very quick. But then we have this one. This model uh, took quite a while I painted the armor to look like bone and uh, th with the robotic parts I painted them uh, to still resemble a robot so he's not just a skeleton with a gun so uh, but also if you look closely at the base on this one you can see what else I got going on some Jawa bases that's right uh, some scenic resin bases made by me Jawa balls uh, this is my Necron Tomb World style base uh, these um, are available for sale. If you are looking to really accentuate your Necron army, there you go. See, uh, uh, the crystal is coming up out of the ground. And I also show you how to paint this base uh, as part of the video set. So yeah, man, Necron bases are available. Uh, they come in sets of 10 infantry, 5 terminator size, uh, and 3 monstrous creature. So hook it up. They'll be up on my site real soon as part of my uh, relaunch for 2010 uh, with these this batch of new videos and new bases. Uh, I've reset the uh, the website. So absolutely, check it out. Uh, if uh, you would like to purchase them immediately, just email me, Jowaballs at Hotmail, and uh, we can start hooking you up right away. So anyway, that's my Necron set, but there's more. For you Tau lovers out there, how to paint Tau Fire Warrior. Again, this is just a basic set. I only painted one of them. Uh, but uh, it looks pretty nice. And I also talk about options on how other ways to paint him as I painted. I gave you a couple of options for colors. So um, uh, definitely worth checking out. I think I did a decent job with this model. And he did not take very long. It's surprisingly easy to paint these things. Um, and this is also one of my scenic resin bases, which I show you what I did. Very simple. I did not put a lot of time into painting this thing, and that's you know how quickly you can make your army look good with hardly any effort at all. Uh, that's uh, my representation of what a, the Tau home world would look like—very arid and dry steps. Uh, that's my cobblestone scenic resin base, um, and it can be also painted in grays and to be more of a traditional old world cobblestone. But I painted this uh, one with browns and uh, desert looking arid broken rocks. So here's the rest of the squad that I've been working on bit by bit. You know, you can see the different colors here um, to show you the examples of how different ways I paint them. So uh, there's my Tau. And here is. An Eldar Fire Warrior, or no, Fire Dragon. Eldar Fire Dragon Exarch. He is on one of my scenic resin bases as well. Lava Rock. Um, bubbling rocks, bubbles uh, with rocks floating in it. It looks like uh, 
you know, it also could substitute for Nurgly base with a uh, bubbling ooze. And this is a very high level model. Um, you can see the levels of blending I did with him. Forgive the uh, the the broken paint on the back there. I, I dragged him <laughs> when I was basing him. I uh, messed up his back. But uh, you can see the the blending. You know the the yellow. I show you how to paint yellow for the helmet and uh, and how to do the shading. And look look at the lag piece. The blending. That's all in this video set. Absolutely worth the money. So there you go, and the last new batch of stuff I want to show you for now is this. These are my Tyranid resin bases. They're a base Hulk, uh, Space Hulk design to look like a, 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 sh a ship's decking with Tyranid tendrils. You know, little little tendrils, kind of infesting the space Hulk. Here's, you know, just for just for a little sample of what it might look like. Uh, I haven't actually gotten around to painting these things yet. That's how new they are. So, uh, just a sample. If you're looking for some of these bases, I know Tyrion has just came out. Uh, I've got these sets available. In all of my sets, uh, you will also be able to buy them as not only infantry, terminator, and monstrous creature, but you can get them as uh, termagon size base for the flyers and the big creatures, and also as uh, bike bases. So that's all coming up now soon. So all right, that's what's new at Jawa Balls Productions. The last thing I want to say is if, if you if you do purchase one of my videos, by all means, email me if you're not happy. I will give you a full refund. That's my guarantee. If you don't like the videos that you purchase from me, if they don't help you at all, uh, uh, you think it's just total crap, just email me and I will happily give you your money back. So uh, I, you can't beat that. You can't beat a guarantee. Zero risk. <laughs> That's how confident I am that my videos are, uh, are worth purchasing. So, uh, all right. Uh, if you wish to purchase any bases for the time being, email me directly, jawaballs at hotmail, and, uh, we can, and, and I'll just set you up that way. And um, I will accept a uh, credit card, uh, check, uh, and uh, PayPal. All right, enough. That's seven minutes. Jeez. So there you go. New stuff at Jawa Balls Productions. More to come.